Hi everyone, my name is Pratik Vindiala, and I'm back again with another read aloud. Today, we're going to read the book, Tooth Trouble. This book's really going to be important in keeping your teeth clean and going to the dentist when required. Wilbur and his mother were crunching their way through a huge pile of shellfish. Ow, said Wilbur, my tusk hurts. You'll have to go to the dentist, Miss Waller said. I don't want to go to the dentist, said Wilbur. My tusk only hurts when I crunch, said Wilbur. If I take off the shells, I can just slurp them. Have some seaweed, said Miss Walrus. It's nice and soft. Ugh, said Wilbur. I don't want to eat seaweed. It's green and slimy. Then you'll have to go to the dentist, said Miss Walrus. I don't want to go to the dentist, said Wilbur. Wilbur's friends were tusk wrestling. Wilbur loved tusk wrestling. He locked tusks with his friend Walter. Womp! Ow! yelled Wilbur. My tusk hurts. You'll have to go to the dentist, Walter said. I don't want to go to the dentist, said Wilbur. My tusk only hurts when I wrestle, said Wilbur. Let's play on the ice slide with Wanda. Wee! Wanda, Wilbur, and Walter swooped down the slide. Splash! They somersaulted into the sea. That was great! Let's do it again, Walter said. Walter poked his tusks into the ice and pulled himself up onto the ice floe. Wanda poked her tusks into the ice and pulled herself up onto the ice floe. Wilbur poked his tusks into the ice and... Ow! yelled Wilbur. My tusk hurts. You'll have to go to the dentist, Wanda said. I don't want to go to the dentist, said Wilbur. Wilbur continues to refuse to go to the dentist. I'll swim to Grandpa, Wilbur said. It's easy to get out there. He's got a landing slope. It was a long way to Grandpa's. Wilbur's tusks hurt in the cold water. He pulled himself up Grandpa's landing slope and laid there moaning. Tsk, tsk, said Grandpa. He put his flippers around Wilbur's shoulders and helped him up onto the ice floe. What is the matter? My tusk hurts, Wilbur wailed. His whiskers quivered. You'll have to go to the dentist, Grandpa said. I don't want to go to the dentist, said Wilbur. Grandpa smiled. Neither did I, he said. So it looks like Grandpa and Wilbur have a common theme. Both of them not liking the dentist. Miss Walrus waddled up the landing slope towards them. Walter and Wanda said, I'd find you here, she said. Is your tusk still hurting? Yes, said Wilbur. I'll have to go to the dentist. Finally, said Miss Walrus. After a long time, Wilbur finally agrees to go to the dentist. Dr. Tusker, the dentist, was very gentle. I see what the problem is, she said. You've got a piece of shell stuck in the top of your tusk. There, I've taken it out. That feels much better, said Wilbur. If you brush your tusks 
twice a day with the special fish flavor toothpaste, your tusks will be stronger and shiny, said Dr. Tusker. She gave Wilbur a sticker. It said, I brush my tusks. So Wilbur learned he must brush his tusks to keep them healthy and clean. Wow, said Grandpa. I wish I had tusks like yours. Dr. Tusker will make you a false tusk, said Wilbur. You'll have to go to the dentist. I don't want to go to the dentist, said Grandpa. Tss, tss, said Wilbur. He put his flipper around Grandpa's shoulders. If I can go to the dentist, so can you. So Wilbur is even teaching his grandpa a key lesson of going to the dentist. And that's it. I hope everyone of you enjoyed reading. Thank you and all of you. I hope you have a good day.